How's it going guys? I hope you guys are having a good day. Um, today I'm going to be spraying the rear diffuser on my new S3 um, and give you guys a little update of the situation, um, what has been going on and where we're at now because we have uh, definitely moved along very fast. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get started. Okay guys, so this is the old S3. I don't know if I've showed you guys this before. As you can see, literally not a lot left. Um, I need to take some more bits off, like the rear um, rear brake carriers and stuff. But uh, yeah, this is what, how we're looking on the uh, new one so far. Obviously got the seats in um, and uh, took it for its first drive yesterday. And it feels pretty damn good. Um, but yeah, I just want to spray the diffuser today. Gloss black, I've got paint. So I'm going to go ahead and start getting cracking on with that. And uh, yeah. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and start off by just wiping down the rear diffuser, making it all clean. And then I'm going to go ahead and get the paint out. Um, mask all around the end. Also, you get some newspaper, cover up all the panels. Um, and then yeah, ready for some paint. So I've currently got a light literally shining on the car as well as all the lights in the garage and my floodlight up there. So it's pretty damn lit up at the minute, but uh, I've literally just had to use the heat gun to heat up the tape and a bit of the bodywork because the um, it's so cold. Well, it seems to be cold to, to the tape anyway. Like it, uh, it wasn't sticking, so I've just heated up the whole tape. I heated up the rear bumper a bit so it seems to be sticking a lot more now so i'm gonna go ahead and carry on masking it off and then i've got some newspaper i'm gonna put some paper all around the back uh, and then wipe down the diffuser probably uh tape over the tips uh not really sure why because i'm going to be ordering a whole new system soon but um anyway i'll get back to you guys once i've got the boot covered okay guys so got the whole rear end all taped up and masked so I'm gonna go ahead and give this a full wipe down and then hopefully be ready to give it a good bit of paint. I've got gloss black paint and a bit of lacquer, uh, but I do think that these little little touches here and there, like painting this, hopefully painting the front as well for the uh, front little um, lip, say. Uh, gloss black another day, but I think these little touches definitely make a difference. Um, and then, uh, yeah, I don't, know, I don't know if I've actually updated you guys as well. I've actually got the black rings installed now and the S3 badge, as well as I've done the D-Wiper delete. If you guys want to see how to do that, I have already made a video of it um, on a old A3 I had. Um, and it's exactly the same, exactly the same uh, process. Um, so uh, yeah, I'm going to go ahead, clean up this diffuser, and then I'll go ahead and get back to you guys. Okay guys, so I've gone ahead and degreased all the diffuser so it's now clean and this is what I'm going to be using, gloss black um, spray paint, Autotech. Um, I've used this in the past and to be honest I've only used it again because the finish that what I have previously used it on was more than enough for me to be happy with. So I'm going to go ahead and get you guys mounted and then I'll go ahead and start spraying it down. Okay guys, so this is after a couple of coats now, it's currently still glossy, um, I'm just going to go ahead and let it dry and then go ahead and give it a couple more coats and I'll come back to you guys, but so far it does not look bad at all, there's a little bit of some uh, bubbles or whatnot here, but I believe after a few coats it will disappear, but otherwise looking good i reckon it's gonna look loads better and i've ordered the uh tinted rear lights as well so the rear end 
it's gonna look pretty damn naughty on this once uh, once everything's on um, as well as get the rear window tinted and the side windows obviously and uh, yeah but we're getting there guys literally I just remembered actually today we might be getting getting some coilovers for the front of this and, oh, sorry got hiccups and uh, once they're on I reckon this is going to look really good as you guys can see I've got the lowering springs from my old one um, on here now so it's actually squatted down a little bit on the back uh, but again the front needs to be done next so uh, yeah we're definitely getting there guys um, so uh, yeah just waiting for the postman really for all my little bits and bobs that I've ordered so if you guys seen a video previously I had a little Ford Fiesta which I recently done a cam belt and water pump on and I've actually managed to sell that yesterday um, so I literally went on a little bit of a spending spree um, I was spending like £500 worth of parts just to uh, get this car moving um, and uh, hopefully soon fully insured and then we'll go ahead and take it out and do like a POV driving video and uh, yeah we just need to get the exhaust and just get, get everything sort of ready for the stage 2 plus so we can just get it at the stage where I was at before this whole incident Okay guys, so I'm currently going to take the tape off now. I've finished spray painting the rear diffuser. I'm currently trying to fix a little um, a little blemish here. I'm pretty damn happy with it to be honest. It looks a lot better without that diffuser being a different colour, but there is a little blemish. I don't know if you can see on camera here, which I've actually tried to touch up and hopefully it will won't look so bad when it's dry and plus when it's out on the road and everything this gets dirty and everything so you're not really going to be looking at it for imperfections but so i've reapplied paint here um just trying to get it as perfect as possible really but yeah that needed to be done that is so much better dead happy with it and then the front i just need to do the little uh center bit of the um bumper but uh yeah so much more better another thing ticked off the list anyway obviously we're gonna put the wheels black the rear lights are on the way down now when they're down they'll be on straight away and tinted windows and it's gonna look like a freaking proper blacked out machine i think so yeah I'm gonna go ahead and end this video here guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. From whatever clips I did get, I've sort of been in and out of here doing this as well as doing some bits and bobs inside the house. So, uh, yeah. Anyway guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll go ahead and see you guys in the next one.